morning, good afternoon, and good evening, whenever and wherever you are. Welcome back to the beat-up plan as we return to our Crimson Chateau estate within the darkest dungeon. This time I'm going to go for the deeds. And the fortifying garlic. I'm not sure if I like this trinket a lot. It's a lot of defense, but sometimes I have the feeling that... Oh, the offense is the best defense. I'm not sure about that, but... Well, Deeds, we also pumped in quite a bit of money into this team, but we are getting 11,000 out of it. And this is the team I'm going to go out with. Doctor Strange, Kiddo, so we have Bix and Heels and Big Stress Heels. And if Doctor Strange fails, we have Jordan. And then we have Sergeant Gruff. Didn't want to put any level 4 guys in against, well, the boss, but I just don't want yet another focus ring. I already have to. So we're going to go for the fortifying garlic. And, uh, well, afterwards, we're going to try and see if we can... For instance, Pour a little bit over here, but this one I, I I just really want the deeds, and therefore provision of this team. Um, just gonna rely on the dark herbs will be needed. And torches, definitely. All right. This is what I'm gonna go out with. We're gonna get 11,000, so that will bring us back to. Let's say eight, uh, 85,000. We need 15,000 in stuff in order to... Actually, a little more. But 20,000 in order to... Well, make even on this run. And that's 20,000 on top of the 11,000 that we will earn for... Uh, just to be I knew all these clear. paths once. Now they are as twisted as my own ambitions. 90% of room battles. Man, this is a whining place. Expect a two, uh, a two staged episode. Last episode also Before was really, really short, for which I, I apologize, but yeah, well, kind of thought that the, the Shrieker would hang around, but apparently he didn't. Quivering ectoplasm. Alright. Too bad. Um, also, yes, we have not equipped his finale. We have equipped the ground Harvest in order to get double bleeds off. And the other skill was completely underdeveloped and locked. And I already put quite a bit of uh, money into the team that I didn't want to unlock even more. And we also unlocked Bellow, which could get a kill here and lower his speed, but I don't see the point. I think I just, just kill you. Yep. Death by inches. Ectoplasmic profusion. Doesn't that call up the really big guy? Yep. Lovely. No stress. Um lower his damage. Bellow! Kill a guy and unfortunately he resists the debuff, though, get, though he's already really slow, so it probably doesn't matter too much. Big slime? Alright. What's the debuff? Minus speed. Yeah, well, whatever. In fact, speed up. Speed up, folks. Let's go. Well struck. Let's see how much we can debuff a slime. Masterfully executed. I didn't take it again. But yeah, I did unlock Sergeant Gruff's bellow. I wanted to see it in action for once in a dungeon. I have heard good things about it, but I never used it myself, so... Consider this the experiment. Impressive. We are uh, doing this a little too much, folks. We don't need to. By the way, Sergeant Gruff is, as you can see, loaded for protections and stun chance. I'm surprised that it didn't actually work there. Ah, oh, the little guy is fine. He's so dead. There we go. Um, just keep on debuffing this guy. He has minus 37% damage. That's actually kind of low. How the heck did that happen? 
Boom! We're critting so much, dudes. Save up Prodigious something for the rest of the dungeon. Does not the sharpened blade. Well, perhaps this will just be a big old, old heirloom run. And we'll just have to take that decrease in money. Let's go here. The skeleton won't work, but it work will work on the doggy. There you go. Um blup. Oh! Did not kill. Too bad. Continually on that did. Destroy them all. That won't kill. Alright, then let's, let's just stun. A dizzying blow to body and brain. Which matters not because we have an occultist and a jester. So your attacks are in vain. Haha, <laughs> yes, it, I did make it rhyme in, in the end. I was wondering, like, how am I going to do that? But I, I managed. Give them I managed. no quarter. Oh. We did. Uh, oh, yeah, we did lower his damage by 20% thanks to the rampart shield. Ah, oh well, oh well. There we go. Inspiration no stress. And improvement. Unless you crit again. Then we're gonna get stress. But we can also exsanguinate. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. There we go. Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. I didn't choose a key. Didn't need to, apparently. Was pretty good. I'm gonna keep it like that. What we do greatly miss in this group is scouting chance. I did equip the Book of Scouting, but we don't have, for instance, the Ancestral Map, which helps a lot with that, but yeah. Uh, best is Armor, I think, is our Jester. Yeah. At 85, he's not bad. We have bandages, so we can use this. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. I guess we're gonna do it like that. Not has doesn't really have my preference to throw away one of these in the onyx. Poo. No, we'll we'll keep the bandages for now. Ninety percent of rooms. I guess we're gonna detour here and then go back and then leave this one room. Leave it be. There is. Food, but let me see, let me see. Rabies. Minus accuracy plus damage. Hey, not what I prefer to see. Good, another scout. Um, no, I'm gonna leave it like that. Thank you very much. Oh, there we go, another bandage. Good valuables. Glittering gold, trinkets and baubles, paid for in blood. Yeah, let's use that in order to get rid of a bandage and create some light for the next fight. Ah! Oh. Ew. Ew. Can I reach him before with a stun before I can he go act? I don't know. Yes, I can. There we go. Nice stun. And I guess we're going to work on your damage. Grief. Oh, that had to be a crit. Please don't stun as well. Why did I even try and ask? Minus 74% damage, that's quite significant. You are dead as well. Hmm, 
that's quite all right. Let's try and lower your speed. There we go. Minus six speed. Death. Unforeseen. That allows me to take all my actions before he goes, and that is mainly what I was looking for here. I should have actually lowered his damage again, probably. Um, stress heal for days, because we are good like that. Actually, our bright tambourine isn't working at the moment, because we're just below 75% uh, torch light. Yeah, we need to be very strategic with our... Uh, with our torchlight creation. But I don't think we need it in this fight, actually. We're controlling it really well right now, because also he has lower speed. We have stun chances. I think he's dead. If you say so, Wayne. Um, not yet, but we're gonna camp out real soon. I think I'm gonna do this fight in darkness. Or in darkness at least. I'm not gonna light a torch here. Oh, we're, we're not completely in the dark, so that's pretty good. Another crit. Very nice. Critting a lot in this dungeon. Fortunately, he went too quick before our... Just a good Such a hit him powerfully. Cannot be left unanswered. Um, no. Let's first do Bellow. Only one debuff landed. I am not digging that skill at the moment very much. That was a kill though, and that is a heal of way too much, but okay. Better way too much than another zero, right? We, we already had that one. Turns. Okay, we'll stress heal. Fine, you made your point. You made your point, sir. A powerful blow. What is with this dungeon? It's crit heaven on both sides. I mean, I'm... Well, I wanted to say I'm okay with it, but I'm not sure if I am okay with it, Momentary because abatement. now I can't control the fight in order to stress you enough. Slowly, gently, this is how a life is taken. Kaboop. Mm, no. Not gonna heal you. We aren't low enough for the occultists. And don't really think that the flagellum needs it right now. A time to perform beyond one's limits. Give up. Bumped. Lots of gold. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Fine. It's a bit of a shame of the the anti venom, but. I should have done the herbs instead of the anti-venom. I don't know. If only I'm glad I kept it, though. The flow of otherworldly corruption. We can't take this with us. We need room. So we will camp out soon. And we're going faster through this dungeon than I expected. Oh, sorry. There was a scout here. But, uh, yeah. We're really dark, so let's just go. This is... More or less efficient. Kindling. It's a goal without hope. I don't really need to do that, so let's just do that. Perhaps I could have saved a little bit on the food now that I realize. But alright, let's first do Dark Immune. Yes, it will give us extra stress, but we will get rid of it later on. No worries. Um, all companions. Ten. They all got the crit buff. Yowza. Um... One companion, accuracy, and crit buff. All companions. Yeah, let's just do less stress for all companions. That is pretty good. And then we have two left for... We don't need that. Oh, Lash's Kiss for extra speed. And funny enough, we could make use of the heal buff. The match is struck. A blazing star is born. Okie dokie. Okay. 
there's the heirlooms. I will definitely go for the deeds. I agree with that. Choice. Light a torch for some efficient torch lighting. They're gonna be a hearty hit. General, but let's do this. Of course, the ones that it matters for, they resist everything. Yay! Yeesh. Singular strike. That is nice, and then uh, we'll kill at least one of them. Great is the and the that one on of them is own. pretty low on health. Thanks to that mm, fortuitous crit. Despite the fact that Kiddo is marked, he won't be attacked because these guys can only hit the first two ranks. So, no need to take off the mark, just kill her and it will all be fine. Let's sing ourselves a little inspiring tune to light up the moon. And. hit you. Because now I think you're going to have some clumsy swipe or something if you're in the third position. Though I'm not sure if the corpse will bleed out before... No, it won't. Okay, good. You have a lot of bleed issues and you have a lot of damage issues. Minus six speed, minus six speed is already taken care of. Control the fight. And... Up. No, oh, that's about The stress is too low for me to matter right now. Harmless swipe, there it is. And you push your fellow member into a harmless swipe room region. I like it. I will heal now. There's no need to leave the flagellant so low when... There is no need to stall that much. I'm not noticing a lot of that rabies plus 15% damage. In total it's only minus 5, but now they have protections of course a lot, but... And you will die in the next turn, so it's time for that major stress relief of 3 points. Kill? Oh, one HP left. No, two HP actually. Uh, that's a leper exclusive one. At least yeah. Us a success. Uh, of only in damage position one. That does what it tend to be, but I kind of like what we have going on here. So, oh, unless I want to throw away the food, that's a little too early. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, leper. Handsome reward. The deeds will Your come with us, though. Well performed. Fine. Fine. Throw away the herbs. Too bad. Too bad. Spent too much cash on... Kuro interaction stuff. Oh, this is a team that can lower the light and cause some serious stress. damage. You are already dead. Stun you. And we're gonna lower your damage. It's not gonna help anything with uh, horror and what have you not, but... Actually, just speed ourselves up. We have a team here, I just realized, that can speed themselves like crazy and can lower the speed of the enemy like crazy. We can guarantee more or less always that our team acts before they act. Which is noticeable here already. Uh, 110, we have 170. There's still a 60% chance that we'll stun. Resist it, but... A rent of 2 damage. Whoa, oh, that damage debuff. Oh, 
111 damage debuff. Bellow, debuff the speed. Um, Dirk Stamp, we'll do 5 to 9. You have 13. This could kill. Yep. Their cursed champion falls. Sniper's Ring, we already own one. Thank you very much. Um, it's too early to throw anything else away, I think. Oh, in radiance, inefficient we light. Uh, we don't have anti-venom anymore. Could have thrown away some of the food, I know, but it's, it's just a little too early for my liking. We are going so fast through this dungeon because we're not cheesing. We don't need to cheese. This team is working out just fine right now. Back up things loot. With loot are often low on supplies. I want the cash, yo. Fine. The, light, the promise of safety. Dollar dollar cash for the torches. Because we still have a full stack and we have a camp left, so. I say we'll do it like that. You are dead. You are dead. Then I'm actually going to debuff your damage. Instead of uh, doing an abyssal artillery. Lower the damage. Everybody, uh, lower the, the speed. Everybody debuffed. Park prey, alright. Cytokinesis. Alright. Stress for everybody, but it's minor. We'll be able to handle that. We've resisted everything. Oh my, the what now? The runs? I always forget what these diseases do. What does the runs do? Minus 10% maximum HP, minus 20 dodge. You prick. Enough damage. Another rate of blind. Don't give me another disease, man. Why did I even say it? We can't reach the fourth rank well enough. That is really annoying. Although bulimic is like, I think the mildest of disease that you can get. Oh. You have to do this because no one else can reach very well back there. Oh my dear lord, I didn't realize it was that bad with your health. With the, the blight, I should say. No! I don't have empty venom! Monster's size has no intrinsic merit, unless inordinate exsanguination be considered a virtue. This is bad, man. Now he will be on a 1 HP. Oh. That crit was not good. Will you stop? We almost had three people with disease coming out of this place. Okay, this is a good fight to cheese. We will cheese. For some reason, you're not below 50 HP. I am really surprised. We really need to speed ourselves up to make sure that we are ahead of the enemy. You need to heal. I don't think, however, they can hit the back rank, these guys. Is a rarity in the fever pitch of battle. Yo, go slower. I'm a crit for some stress relief. Our stress is just doing really fine. Not just because we have a jester, but because we're critting so much. We are really critting like a 
that case. A brilliant confluence of skill and purpose. No, I'm not crazy. No, it probably would have been better if I just used the heal of... of I don't know, man, because that is yes, a double amazing. heal, which is so good about it. But yeah, here we go. Not a crit. Bump in the night. Surprising amount of skeletons in this area, by the way. Like, really. There's no need for this amount of skeletons. These nightmarish creatures can be felled. They can be beaten. Fine, we'll start lowering this food stack. We have to know at a certain point that we have to start throwing things away in order to uh, gain enough wealth out of this area to make it worth. Wealth in heirlooms or in anything else. It's it's fine. It, we're doing s this dungeon so fast. We're not even half an hour in and we're... Wow, I'm surprised about that. Um, We are also in the wrong party order, I just realized. Oh, uh, that's good money. Certainly. I'm gonna leave the rest. That's fine. You can also camp with just two food, don't forget that. And we can still camp with your four food. And I'm not... I, I think we might be done after this corridor, but... No, I think we need to backtrack for one or two rooms. Finding the stuff is only the first test. It's fine. Now it must be carried home. I'm actually going to let the torchlight dim here. We'll take this fight, we'll let it go low, and we'll start preparing for another camp that's gonna be ahead. I also don't know why we're surprising so much. We don't have a trinket for that. Ooh, is that a dodge? Yes, it was. That's annoying. In that case, don't bellow, but get her stunned. She is now dead. I don't know why I'm talking to you like this is an action, action after report, and I don't know why I failed that so much. Oh no, a crit. No. A crit of two. A stress, but we have a jester, so it doesn't matter. Oh yeah. Okay, they replace the old woman with four slimes, as you wish. Our stress heal, of course, has become become a little less efficient due to the fact that we are fighting in the dark, or more in the dark, so. Voila, two slimes gone. No. Oh. Okay. We have the time for you. Good, because I don't want to kill yet. I want to set up the kills for the next round. Ah, too bad. Three hit points, he's dead. Okay, then let's just kill. Then we just kill. That's not really a good That's reward for... Smart. I mean, it wasn't so like a tough fight, but still, resistance. it's not really a good reward. Um. Yeah, I'll just walk in the dark a little. Okay, now I'm starting to get worried about a camp. No, let's go with somebody who already has a disease. Awesome. We're getting a little low on food there. Nature herself, a victim to the spreading corruption. We still have them. With misintent. Uh, that's good cash. Fine, I have an idea. As the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted. Would like a few more purposes made clear. All right. 
annoying, but not something we cannot overcome. Double dodge is bad, though. Bellow, everything debuffed. Alright. I know we have some stress, but let's take care of this guy. Alright, so it's Mark Brave on him. The Flagellant can take that over, though, next turn. If need be. May not, need not be, because it is, of course, the Man-at-Arms, who has protections already, so he's doing pretty well. Yeah, but I still think it's good for the heals and, and the Exsanguinator, what have you not. And unfortunately, he didn't die before. Dagnabbit! I can't reach! I can't reach! Only that way I can reach, which is kind of a dumb way to reach. And now I screwed myself because I can't reach this way because she is... <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> because the carbs did die now because of bleeding and does its Terracorps. Yeah. Oops. It's okay. We'll start stress relieving. Just leave those two alive and it will be fine. Just kill her. It's all about killing her. So, you know what? Let's get rid of the corpse. Let's get some stress relief going. Because they should be super low, slow. There we go. There's a crit. Keep on shouting these man... Mushrooms down. That's the best thing I can say they are. They have minus 7 dodge, minus 6 speed, or minus 12 speed even. Oh, one stress. That's pretty low. 18, 19. We'll take care of that. And I'm noticing that I'm not at all worried with the flagellant at this low health, because it's just like, oh, okay, cool, now I can use my extremely powerful abilities to immediately get me to some crazy amount of health. Looky there! This team, because... Because Doctor Strange is doing well now, now it feels like this team could... In a form or sense, compete with the For All That Is Good team. As in, low stress, big heals. We do have a double... Uh, that was completely unnecessary. Because I was talking to you guys and I wasn't paying attention. Can still stun you. They are equal in stress heals because it's simply a jester, and a jester is just awesome in stress heals. They do lack the amount of control that the other team lacks. There's only one stun on this team. Well, actually, there's a second one on him, but that lowers the light. I mean, this team would be pretty good in if you were doing a no light dungeon. And uh, then you would need a Dark Tambourine, for instance. You're gonna have to equip a few things differently, but... Getting crits... Well, we can be healed to stress. Um, we have two heroes then, then you would have him, perhaps, more to the front and you on the back spot? Yeah, and then him on the third spot, possibly. Because Bellows works from the third spot, Rampart does, but... No, uh, Crush doesn't. Uh, it would be a bit of a weird composition. But yeah, it is true, however, that nowadays the Occultist will also heal from the first position. Is this me or is... That looked really skewed, the way that was presented the team order. Ooh. That might not have been the best move I could have made. We're now just stress relieving from cr critting. Which I'm fine with. You should be dead. No! 1 HP! <laughs> Phew. I was really expecting a big ass old crit here now, just to... Cultist? Cultist getting a kill, man, folks. A trifling victory. Um... But a victory, nonetheless. We don't need the shuffles probably anymore, so... Uh... Um, whoever is feeling like can do it. That really doesn't matter. Um, yeah. We're going to do this whole dungeon in one episode. 
Why are we? And the shovels is, is good, and then we'll keep the keys, hopefully still hoping for a secret room. Like, we haven't seen a secret room outside of those that we found in the courtyard in, like, ages. That's fine. Although not really pleasant. Because I probably want to camp just to make some light. And then I'll need to eat too. And then I don't have enough for a full meal. Which is a bit of an annoying thing. Also certainly when we get two food activations on the return journey. Hmm. Am I going to camp? I don't think so. I think I'm just gonna fight, fight in the darkness. And let the bright tambourine be whatever it is. Just get rid of him and everything will be fine. Not ideal, but not a big problem. Start to bleed on you. Lower your damage. That I shouldn't have done because of that. Shoot. Oopsie. I made a boo boo. Ten. You are going down quickly now, though. Flurry of Claws! Well, that's a little annoying, but damage wise is not that bad. Um. Oh! Really? I mean, I know he has 40% protections, but still. Oh, come on, please, I need a stress heal. Fine. Whatever. I guess I'll cheese another font. I wanted to stun, to be honest. There you go, you're dead. We'll leave these two be. Hopefully they won't constantly stun my Jester so they can start stress healing. And they will stop critting me so that we can prevent all the issues that are now developing at this moment. Okay. We can do this. That's not so much of a problem. That is actually kind of good. You just bumped us back into the same position. There aren't too many people that are that hurt that they need anything else. I'm going to mark myself just to get some protections. And hopefully that they will focus on him a little bit more. And I'm going to bellow and hopefully lower your speed. Thank you. That is kind of what I was looking for. There we go. 74% extra protections. And removing the other issues. Um, lower damage. There we go. Get the crits up. I think this is working. Hopefully we'll get some food from this fight. Two food would be awesome. That's all we need. And we're controlling the fight a little bit by letting only one go. I will heal this because apparently they are now incapable of going through the protections. That's not a crit, which I really prefer you didn't do. Mm. 
No, okay. Not exactly what I was looking for in regarding in regards to the heal. Good round for us. A round in which they hardly did any damage. A round where I can where they did no stress damage. So that we can really start getting that down. They are fast again though, I should have taken that into account, I, which I didn't. Compassion is a rarity mm. in the fever mm. pitch of battle. Let's just get somebody to zero at least, so that if he needs to protect that that works as well. I don't think you guys can bleed. No, you have a, like an extremely high bleed chance, but let's just start killing. And we'll start in camp and hopefully get some food and then work the rest out. That's unfortunate. Which means all the more good reason to just stop with this. Cheesing strategy, that is amazing, That's thank you. So clearly in view. Or is it merely a trick of the light? I really want to create some light, if uh, you would be so kind. Let's first just go over here. Because we have no food in order to camp. Which I should have taken into account, just... Just do it like this, because we can't rely on getting food. Ah, uh, not him in the complete darkness! He can do so much damage! But not stress damage, unless he crits. Which would be really annoying, but... Wow, a dodge! You know what? F you. Um, the to do. Lower your damage! I think that's a good idea. And I also think it is a good idea if you get stunned so that you are dead. Confusion spores. This is annoying because lots of chance to crit and the party order can be switched around to terrible positions. And I don't have Finale, but the Jester is very move mobile, which is good in this case. There we go. And I think Rampart can be done from the third position, so we can do this. Hopefully get a stun off. Yes. Perfect. Uh, we don't need to knit the flesh. Lower the damage again. And stress heal as... Uh, nutcase. Tree Bench Smackdown. Woof. It wasn't as bad as a cami. Lower your speed. Nice. Just get that stress relief. That's really good. And then you do zero heal at the moment that we needed 28 or so. Which you have done quite a few times in this dungeon, I am aware, but then you don't do it at the moment that it is actually good. Which is really annoying. Well, you have been stunned, your hit points are definitely going down quickly, our stress is actually doing quite well. This is a critical, not a 28, but it is a critical. Um. Yeah, I'm almost considering that the Bright Tambourine wasn't that good of an additional add, because now I think... Plus 15% stress if Torch below 51. But it's still plus 20% stress yield. That's always active, so... What is your stun resistance? 40, 110, I have... Uh, actually a 60% chance to stun you still. If I calculated that correctly, and it doesn't seem like it. 
and uh, you will probably be dead after this, which is very nice. Very nice indeed. And stress it a little bit more. There we go. Stress is really getting low, and you will be dead. Um, yeah, crit. No. Okay. Why do we not get any extra deeds, please? I would so love a few extra deeds. Surprised. In the darkness. Nice. Uh, oh, I just realized I am not really in the right order. So we'll take a little hit there. Annoying as he has area of effect damage. And with this team, we are not as good as handling that. That is an amazing stun towards the back, though. Um, which makes me say, lower your damage. Uppercut slice, freeze and damage, pretty good. And then we'll try and focus this guy down immediately, because this, this area of effect damage, because we don't have an area of effect heal, which is the Vestal is the only one that has it, it uh, can be pretty gnarly. Don't forget though, he has stress attacks. Nicely dodged by most people, and this will be awesome once again. Even if the bleed doesn't land, but it lands twice. Nice. Lower your damage even more. Grievous then the crit. Sometimes it's fear. funny to me that no matter the damage of the crit, they will always get the same amount of crit, dam uh, crit damage. It's a little like, what kind of a ridiculousness is that? That was only a crit damage of four. Why would you get stressed over that? You should laugh about that. Like, that was a crit? Four damage? Ha 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 ha. These guys suck. But instead, it's like, oh no, he critted! Uh, what hell, whatever shall we do? He critted us! Get yourself stunned. Move to the back. This dungeon now lasted longer than I expected in the end. Oh, he's very, very dead. A momentary abatement. There we go. Uh, I really don't want to kill you just yet. I would love to get a stress you off. 18, 12, you are the, mo you are the most. There we go. Efficient healing. Efficient stress healing. 4,500 bucks. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzying fall. This together is 3,000. This is 1,000. I guess over the keys. And I guess two portals are better than three deeds. Yes. Even if we really would like deeds. Food! Of course, now you give me food. The two food I need for the camp. Dang, never it, you bastard of a game. Sometimes you really do it on purpose. You... Hunger sets in, turning the body against itself, weakening the mind. Um, there's the third portrait. That's awesome. Light a torch, just for the hell of it. Walk on, and we are going to go and find a fight and stress heal everything so that the game can go and F itself because I really don't like it when it does that at the very end there's one more fight ahead good hopefully it's one that we can control and cheese and what have you not haunting the hearts of men and we have a big 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 time rewards out of this dungeon though that is really good. Completely in the darkness, the last fight. And one that we can definitely cheese. Awesome.
First get the numbers advantage, then we'll start healing. Little bit of crit... Uh, heal, uh, stress heal. I hope to get out of this dungeon with zero stress. That is my goal. That is a double stun on the slime smack. That is not good. That is neither really good. Um, stress heal with you. And get rid of these two things. And after that we'll have to go and uh, stress heal a little bit, but... Right now, this is what it is. Big slime. Big it. Means that we can freaking get ourselves some health back. There we go. 34 crit heal. Oh, sometimes it's nice when things are going your way in the end. Actually, it's probably always nice when things are going your way in the end. Um... Uh, you, get yourself stunned. Thank you. But because you're a two-size enemy, you will never get reinforcements. And of course, we're not going to touch this tent because I've never gotten any special goodies out of a tent, so I don't think it is worthy of trying that out. More stress relief, that's awesome. Should be careful not to kill it too fast. I'm probably not going to leave with zero stress, but I'm going to definitely remove a ton of it. Alright, we will heal that up. Kiddo is going to give some attention to himself. And he's going to get some extra attention. That is not really a good heal there, Doctor Strange. Um, get yourself a little marked. That might be good. Gadget self stun sir. Yes, well, actually, I'm calling it a sir, but it's just a slime. Alright. Goodbye. That is zero stress, at least on someone, and it's only a two point waste of stress heal, so I was willing to take that. There we go, there is the big heal, and then, of course, we bloody, bloody well get ourselves. Debuff. Do you have a minus 10 speed now, thanks to the debuffs? Wow. Okay. I should have taken over the bleed! What am I doing? That's a little annoying that our... Our, um, our debuff and stun person is currently deactivated, but... There we go. Start hitting him again because we're doing pretty well on the stress uh, side of things. Big slime again. That's only a five hit. That's really not that big. You got debuffed by a lot of things, dude. Your bleed resistance, your your everything. Here, get another debuff. Just damage debuff. And with an including of a stun. If we would get a crit, there is a chance that we will leave very satisfied out of this dungeon. You actually you actually have protections indeed. And you are already dead from the bleed. Done it. Six, five, five. So six it will be. And then hopefully a crit that will stress you. No. <laughs> Uh, Bellow for crit? Nope. I tried, but it is dead and the dungeon is defeated. Uh, nothing in here that we can take with us. Everything is at the max. I am a-okay with this, and I say we're gonna get out. Every cleared path and charted route reduces the isolation of our troubled estate. Yes, indeed. And we got our money back. 20,000 I said at the very beginning. So... We did very well, and the heirlooms, and what have you not. And of course, the people, they can improve, although we do got a lot of diseases. Evasive is a nice one, though. Deviant tastes for kiddo, I'm not surprised. The yips. 
Minus 5 accuracy. Ugh, gruff. We have to get rid of that. But I say I thank you for watching, and remember, great peril Women yields great men, beauty. Soldiers and outlaws.